Hello everyone and welcome to Know Your Drug. The ultimate destination for all things of health and wellness from the fascinating world of pharmaceutical. We are here to guide you on caspofungin injection, exploring the various aspects of caspofungin, their usage, dosage, mechanism of action, side effects, and most importantly, essential advice for taking them safely and responsibly. Before we begin, let me emphasize that the content provided in this channel is purely educational. Always consult a healthcare professional for personalized advice regarding medications. Now, let's get started. Use of caspofungin injection. Caspofungin is an antifungal medication that is primarily used for the treatment of invasive fungal infections. It belongs to a class of drugs called echinocandins, which work by inhibiting the synthesis of beta-glucan, a crucial component of the fungal cell wall. Caspofungin is most commonly administered intravenously as an injection. It is indicated for the treatment of the following fungal infections. In invasive aspergillosis, caspofungin is used as a first-line therapy for the treatment of invasive aspergillosis, a fungal infection caused by the aspergilla species. This infection commonly affects individuals with weakened immune systems, such as those undergoing chemotherapy or organ transplantation. In candidemia and invasive candidiasis, caspofungin is effective against various candida species, including candida albicans and candida glabrata. It is used for the treatment of candidemia and invasive candidiasis. In esophageal candidiasis, caspofungin can be used to treat esophageal candidiasis, which is a fungal infection of the esophagus caused by candida species. This condition often occurs in individuals with compromised immune systems or those taking certain medications like corticosteroids. Dosage of caspofungin injection. The dosage of caspofungin injection can vary depending on the specific fungal infection being treated, the patient's age, weight, renal function, and other individual factors. The following dosages are commonly used as general guidelines. In invasive aspergillosis, the recommended dosage for adult is 70 mg on the first day, followed by 50 mg once daily thereafter. The recommended dosage for pediatric patients is 70 mg per square meter on the first day, followed by 50 mg per square meter once daily thereafter, not exceeding the adult dose. In candidemia and invasive candidiasis, the recommended dosage for adults is 70 mg on the first day, followed by 50 mg once daily thereafter. The recommended dosage for pediatric patients is 70 mg per square meter on the first day, followed by 50 mg per square meter once daily thereafter, not exceeding the adult dose. In esophageal candidiasis, the recommended dosage for adults is 50 mg once daily. It is important to note that these are general dosage guidelines and may vary based on individual patient factors. Mechanism of Action of Caspofungin Injection Caspofungin is an antifungal medication that belongs to the class of drugs called echinocandins. It works by inhibiting the synthesis of beta-glucan, an essential component of the fungal cell wall. The mechanism of action of caspofungin can be summarized as follows. Inhibition of beta-1, 3D-glucan synthesis, Fungal cell walls contain a polysaccharide called beta-1, 3D-glucan, which provides structural integrity and stability to the cell wall. Caspofungin specifically targets and inhibits the enzyme called 1,3-beta-D-glucan synthase, which is responsible for synthesizing beta-1, 3D-glucan. By inhibiting this enzyme, caspofungin disrupts the synthesis of beta-1, 3D-glucan, leading to a weakened and defective fungal cell wall. Cell wall integrity disruption. The inhibition of beta-1, 3D-glucan synthesis interferes with the proper formation and organization of the fungal cell wall. As a result, the fungal cells become more susceptible to osmotic stress, cell wall lysis, and subsequent cell death. This disruption of cell wall integrity ultimately leads to the death of the fungal organism. It is important to note that caspofungin has a fungicidal, kills the fungus, or fungi static, inhibits the growth of the fungus, effect depending on the fungal species, concentration of the drug, and other factors. Caspofungin primarily targets certain fungal species such as Aspergillus and Candida by specifically inhibiting beta-1,3-D-glucan synthesis in their cell walls.
Caspofungin's mechanism of action is unique compared to other antifungal agents, such as azoles or polyenes, which target different components of the fungal cell wall or cell membrane. This difference in mechanism of action makes caspofungin particularly useful in the treatment of invasive fungal infections caused by certain resistant or difficult-to-treat fungal species. Side effects of caspofungin injection Caspofungin injection, like any medication, can cause side effects. Not all individuals will experience these side effects, and their severity can vary. It is important to consult a healthcare professional for personalized information and guidance. Common side effects associated with caspofungin injection include fever, nausea and vomiting, diarrhea, headache, rash, abnormal liver function, phlebitis, hypotension. It is important to note that these are not all possible side effects. Some individuals may experience rare or more severe side effects. Important advices for taking caspofungin injection. When taking caspofungin injection, it is important to follow the advice and instructions provided by your healthcare professional. Here are some important tips to keep in mind. Caspofungin injection is typically administered by healthcare professionals in a hospital or clinical setting. It is important to follow the recommended dosage and infusion schedule as prescribed by your healthcare provider. It is essential to complete the full course of caspofungin treatment, even if you start feeling better before the treatment duration is complete. Stopping the medication prematurely may result in the infection not being fully treated and potentially recurring. Always follow the instructions provided by your healthcare professional regarding the dosage, frequency, and duration of caspofungin treatment. Do not change the dose or schedule without consulting your healthcare provider. Make sure to inform your healthcare provider about your complete medical history, including any allergies, existing medical conditions, and other medications you are currently taking. This information will help your healthcare provider determine if caspofungin is suitable for you and if any adjustments need to be made. While receiving caspofungin injection, be aware of any potential side effects. If you experience any unusual or severe symptoms, such as fever, rash, difficulty breathing, or severe injection site reactions, contact your healthcare provider immediately. Caspofungin may interact with certain medications, including other antifungal agents and medications that affect liver enzymes. Inform your healthcare provider about all the medications you are taking to avoid potential drug interactions. If you are pregnant, planning to become pregnant, or breastfeeding, discuss the potential risks and benefits of caspofungin treatment with your healthcare provider. They will consider your specific situation and make recommendations accordingly. Caspofungin injections should be stored as per the instructions provided on the packaging. Follow the storage guidelines and handle the medication safely to ensure its efficacy. It is important to remember that the information provided here is a general guide, and individual circumstances may vary. Always consult your healthcare provider or pharmacist for specific advice and recommendations tailored to your situation. By the end of this video, you'll have a solid understanding of the use, dosage, mechanism of action, side effects, and important advice for taking this drug. Remember, knowledge is power, and being well-informed empowers you to make the best decisions for your health.